Get ready! You're tuned in to Tea Time Unfiltered with your girl, Lovely T, bringing you the hottest trending topics on social media. Stay connected. Instagram.com slash Lovely Tea 2002. Hey, you guys. Welcome to another episode of Tea Time Unfiltered with your girl, Lovely T. Hey, Tea Sippers. Happy Sunday, and I'm back with another podcast. I hope you guys are doing good. So once again, honey, the Prince of Panhandling is back at it. So you guys know over the past few years on my old Instagram page, I would post things about Umar and just his goofy antics. Let's not forget this viral meme that I posted a year ago where he was demanding that that his followers send him gifts and donations. Check this out. Donations. 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 Donations, donations, gifts, 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 more gifts, more gifts. All right, so y'all just saw that crazy video that went viral. And I don't care what nobody says, him saying gifts, 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 donations, donations, donations. Over and over again, y'all know I believe that words cast spells, and I believe he was casting spells over his followers to run and go get him donations and gifts. You know, damn well wasn't no money on them damn Red Lobster gift cards. He took them out the gift card section at Walmart, okay, because they're free. You ain't got to pay for them. All you got to do is load money on there, and he's trying to basically guilt his followers into sending him gifts, 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 donations, donations, donations. Child, you can't make this shit up. Umar has been doing all types of foolishness over the past few years. I used to be a big supporter of his. I've told you guys that in the past, especially being a mother of two boys. I was definitely down for him to open up this school. You know, one of the biggest cheerleaders. Had a lot of hope and faith. You know, even wanted my kids to go to the school. When when he first started talking about it and having aviation classes, teaching kids about agriculture, you know, basically trying to build a structure for young black males. And I thought this was a really good idea. Idea. But then over the years, my perception of him has definitely changed, especially with a lot of his antics and the things he's been caught up in. I mean, it's been over 10 plus years. My oldest child has graduated high school. He graduated in 2019. I'm confused as to how this school has still not been built. Okay. This man has been building this school since my oldest child was in elementary school. I remember having a whole conversation with him when he was like in fifth or sixth grade about this Uma Johnson school and the fact that my child has graduated high school and this school has still not come to fruition is ridiculous. So people started sending me clips of Umar Johnson gambling in Las Vegas. And it was just, you know, with Instagram, there's just one minute short clips. And so I just thought it was a joke at first. I thought, well, maybe he's just passing through. Maybe he's with some friends. So then I sat down and I watched the whole 10 minute video and I was just kind of shocked and appalled. I don't even know why I'm shocked anymore by his antics, but definitely appalled by the foolishness that was Umar Johnson and his behavior in this video was just insane. So I want to go ahead and play y'all this clip. I want y'all to go ahead and watch this and I'm going to come back and break the rest of this foolishness down. But we need about a million and a half for the Frederick Douglass Marcus Garvey Academy renovation. We need about a mil and a half for the Garvey building. We need a mil and a half for the Garvey building. We need two million overall. So we gonna play and we gonna hit the day. We gonna play and we gonna hit the day, family. Let me show you what we about to do. Let me show you what we about to do, family. We about to get us some money for the Frederick Douglass Marcus Garvey Academy. We about to get some money. I need that 1.2 right there. Y'all see that? That's what we need. That's what we need, that 1.2 mil. Y'all see that? That will get the Frederick Douglass Marcus Garvey Academy, the whole campus. This will take care of the whole campus family. This will take care of the whole campus family. That 1.2, that will take care of the whole campus. So we're going to do Will of Fortune, Ifa Tunde style. We're going to do Will of Fortune, Ifa Tunde style. Now, y'all got to help me out because I don't know how to gamble. And I see all kind of shit. I see a will. I see the bar. How do I play this? We need this money for FDMG family. We need this money. So what do I do? Okay. Cash out service. 
We got to play, family. Y'all think I'm playing. How do we play this? How do we, one line of credit. We need this right here. We need this 1.2 to Frederick Douglass Marcus Garvey Academy. We need this 1.2. Do I want one line of credit? Repeat the bet. So what is this? I got to put my credit card in here. What I got to do, family? We need this money. I'm about to straight roll because I might hit. I'm going to hit the service. I just hit the service. I'm going to ask her to show me how this works. One dollar. Can I do a one dollar bet? Excuse me, ma'am. How do you play? I'm not a gambler, but I'm going to gamble today. How do you put the money here? Cash. Cash. How do you know how much to put, or you just choose a random amount? One, five, ten, whatever you want to put. Anything you want. Anything you want. Once you put the money in, we're going to see the credit here. I'm going to see the credit there. And then you could play from one dollar to five dollars bet. So these are all one dollar bets. Yeah. Once I hit one, I'm pulling this. Yeah. And I need three of any one of them to come up. Three. Line up. Line, if it lines up, what happens? You, you could have the spin and win from $25 to the minimum on this. From $35 to $2,000. In order to win anything? Yeah. So if I do anything under $35, i am just playing a play. You ain't going to win nothing. No, no. You need, you need three bars or three spin in order for you to hit the spin. Okay. If you don't get spin, so you don't win. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, you need spin yeah, to win. So if I get three bars. Yeah, three bars, you win $5. Okay, and how do you but get. The main bonus is the spin. And how do you redeem? Let's say I, I win $20. Out and I win. It come right here. So you automatically get notified if I win. No, no, I'm here. I could see it. That's okay, okay. So I just let you know, hey, yeah. I won. Okay, I'm a best with it. Thank you, Mama. So, thank you. So we're going to play, y'all. We're about to play. I'm gonna put 20. I'm gonna put 20 on it. This is not FDMG money, this is my money. So you have an organization? A school that we're building in Wilmington, Delaware. I'm a school psychologist. And we're raising money. We have two schools. We're almost done the small one, but we need a million dollars for the big. <laughs> yes. So. Good luck. I have to sell it. We're so glad you stopped by. All Let's right. Some fun. In order for you to win the million, yes. you need to play five. Now, if you, you don't win play the million, it's okay. So this one has to be here. Okay. okay. Yeah. Now, it's spun automatically? Yeah. So I don't... You could do okay, it. I could do it now. I could do it now. Nothing. Okay. And how do I know how much money I have left? That's Credits. Right. Yeah. Okay. You know what? Let me do another one. We doing another one. Do I still get the last one? Last one, y'all. $20 go that fast. Yeah, because you're playing the $5. Okay, try this one. You want to play more? Try another one. Okay, okay, my mom. Thank you. I'm not doing too good. I lost $20 in one minute, y'all. I can't do this. Okay, I just spent $20. We did three spins. We didn't hit for FDMG. Okay, the ancestors don't want me to get the money this way. The ancestors don't want me to get the money this way, family. We got to get the money with the donations. Hit the cash app. Y'all want me to go broke? Hit the cash app. Dollar sign FDMG school. Hit the PayPal. PayPal.me slash F. Play the dollar machine. Where the dollar machine at? Somebody said play the dollar machine. We got to get these schools done, family. Hit the cash app. Dollar sign FDMG school. PayPal.me slash FDMG Academy. PayPal.me slash FDMG Academy, family. We got to get this money. I might spend 20 more dollars. I don't gamble. But we got to get the money up. This is for the school. Liberation. Y'all said don't gamble no more? Should I do another $20 and cut? Should I do another $20 or just penny slots? How much I'm gonna win at a penny slot? We need a mill, family. We need a mill, family. 
I lost twenty dollars in thirty seconds. I'm not playing that no more. We done. Oakland. I got a question for Oakland. I got a question for Oakland. Oakland family. Oakland family. Where can I get something to eat at when I get to Oakland? I need to get a nice lunch, black owned restaurant in the Bay Oakland. Where can I get something to eat at? Honey, you can't make this shit up. This man literally did a whole live stream of himself in the casino playing these Jedi mind tricks on his followers, trying to act like he has no idea what's going on. He's never gambled. Can somebody give him an award for being one of the best actors to run game on a flock of sheep? Because at this point, Jermaine Shoemaker is doing the most. I'm in Las Vegas, but I don't know how to gamble. He's literally asking for help. He's over here losing $20 in a span of 10 seconds. This man is a trip. And the fact that people are still supporting this foolishness, it just makes no sense. The fact that his followers don't see through this nonsense is really sad. Like he's literally playing these people who have hopes and dreams and who want to see the school come to fruition. And I just don't get it. And at this point, if you're willing to allow Umar to keep stringing you along like a puppy, then you deserve whatever you get. One of the things that disturbing with this live stream is that it's as he's going live, he's saying that the ancestors don't want him to get money this way. So hit the PayPal and the Cash App. Then he started shouting out his Cash App and his PayPal. Yo, what's up? Hey, tea sippers To listen to the rest of this podcast, please go to Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Google Play, Stitcher, Tuned In, or AnchorFM.com, which is a free podcasting site. Thank you guys so much for the support, and stay tuned for the next video.